Well, they say there's no such thing as a bad dog, just a bad dog owner, and that may be true. After another incident on the weekend, an attack in Victoria, a woman was walking with her guide dog in a Victoria park when she says she was bitten on the arm by a pit bull. Now the attack is putting a breed that already has a bad name back in the spotlight, but pit bull owners say don't point fingers just yet. CTV's Joe Perkins reports. If there was a pit bull paradise, these dogs have found it. Don't go running away too far. It's a large backyard away from the city, and the best part, their owner loves pit bulls. I absolutely love their personality. It's why she owns three of them, dogs she says would never attack. The other owner's pit bull just let loose on my dog, it, my six-month-old puppy. But pit bulls running in fields don't make headlines. Victoria Animal Control is investigating an incident this weekend in Bernard Park. A woman walking with her guide dog says she was attacked by what she believes was a pit bull. And the lady herself uh, has three puncture wounds to her right arm. Animal Control says it's unclear if the dog was a pit bull, but the report doesn't come as a surprise. Pit bulls have a really bad rap, and it's unfortunate because it's not true. The Since 2004, only 12% of all dogs designated as dangerous by the city have been pit bulls. It may seem low, but in the past six months, 38% of all reported dog attacks have been from pit bulls. It's almost half, but Ian Fraser believes there may be more to the numbers. I think pit bull incidents do tend to be reported uh, just because they are pit bulls. Dogs many perceive to be dangerous. Well, for ourselves, we don't adopt out uh, pit bulls um, per se because of people's perception. Um, the public seems to be very leery. Um, it, it's almost a, a semi-hysteria. A fear many argue is unwarranted. It's really not the dog. A dog is a reflection of its owner. It's all about being responsible. Good boy. Back in dog paradise, dog owner Jesse admits not every dog is perfect. And that's why it's up to the owner to help out a breed that seems to always take the blame. Joe Perkins, CTV News, Soup.